then it pops out and it can it, it, can it leave the ship. Leave the ship. But I was born after the discovery that the heavy elements that populate the universe and including life on Earth, including us, derive from stars that manufactured them in the crucibles that are their cores and then exploded, scattered that enrichment across the galaxy to enable nascent star systems to have the right ingredients to make planets and on some planets make, I don't know, people. Yeah, people. <laughs> okay. If lightsabers are beams of light, then since beams of light can pass through each other, just see what flashlights do, <laughs> then, then you couldn't have a saber fight with the blades bouncing off each other. Hmm. And I was perfectly happy putting that out there, mm -hmm. but no, <laughs> Brian Cox has to ruin my perfect tweet. So Brian, what some, was your rebuttal? <laughs> with, well, my, with some particle physics facts. Okay, Brian. Well, no, he's not Pascal, it, it's, it's nature facts. It's, it's, <laughs> okay. Um, no, I, I'd, I'd um, worked on um, what we call gamma gamma scattering, which is photons, particles of light scattering off each other. So at very high energies, then there is a reasonable probability that two two particles of light, two photons, will bounce off each other. Okay, so generally today we'll say, if you are of Venus, you are Venusian. And if you're Mars, you're Martian. Martian. And if you're Earth, you're Earthling. This is sort of thing. Earthling is ours? You didn't know that? No, that <laughs> sucks compared to the other It does. It's not ones. as fun. Uh, it's not as fun. We're not Earthians or something. Yeah. So we have Martians and Venusians, but Venusian is the improper word. Really? Okay. okay. The proper word, if you are of Venus, is venereal. Venereal. Yes, and doctors got like to that. Like the disease. 